So this is the Benson Mill. Mm -hmm. This is really interesting. Some of the, the people that built the mill. Uh -huh. And then some and then of the different owners throughout the years. Okay. So and Thomas Lee, he also had a tannery here. And so there was he a... He looked like a pretty tough guy. <laughs> and I know there was a little girl who drowned in the tannery pond, but I'm not sure exactly where that was. Okay. So, uh, some of the claims are a woman mm -hmm. walking around here. Do you spend much time in here at all? I'm just mostly doing tours. Okay. okay. And then you can go down in the basement. There's more equipment down there. And like gear shafts. And... Okay. Yeah, I've seen the owl out the window. That's pretty much all I've seen. Oh, really? <laughs> Owls get upset here at night. But so the turbine's down in there. So if I think I hear some sound, <laughs> could be an owl. That is, uh, wow, that's pretty deep, huh? And there's still water down in there. Okay. But that was run by water also. Okay. But this would be the main drive shaft that ran everything. just unload his grain out on the porch and it would come down and get loaded into the elevators and take it up to the different machinery and so okay. it's, it's like chutes and ladders only it's elevators and chutes yeah <laughs> so it goes up the elevators and comes down the chute. so how is this place powered all by water water mm -hmm. which i guess from the creek here or um there's called twin springs so it's two natural springs and they're what fill up the mill pond so it's just across the road Oh, okay. All that water over there. So they must have troughed it over so, yeah, here they somehow? just dammed that up and built the mill pond, and then they would open a gate. Okay. To bring it, bring it across the road. Okay. That's, wow. A lot of it was here in the mill. Okay. I know all the grinders were originally here 